So we are starting a new run today. We're going to be doing the Dragon Slayer Great Bow. I'm going to try to do bow only, pretty much, because we can't get a great bow right away. So we'll start off with a bow, and then we will go to Iron, uh, Old Iron King. we got to kill him twice and get the uh, Old King. So I don't remember what it's called. Old King Soul or something like that. All right, so Dragon Slayer. There's, I'm not even gonna try. It's not gonna fit. <laughs> Dragon Jibo. Good enough. I think we can pretty much start anything but sorcery or sorcerer, because everything else is gonna give us. So when I planned it, um, we're pretty much leveling everything, but for some reason, like sorcerer was the one class. That would have ended up a higher level than everything else. I don't know. I guess it just has like high starting requirements or, or, or high stats for something. I don't know what. Uh, I wanted to do Bandit though, because I think Bandit has a bow. Does anything else have a bow, actually? Take a quick look. No. Bandit it is. Gift. Uh, healing Wares. Physique. Ripped, build, scrawny. We'll do a lady. Face, Ugh, dude. I wish there was. A... I complain every time, like uh, how there's no good way to make a face quickly, like a, a really just tedious, disfigured face. Eyebrow, real bushy. Perfect. Eye color is fine. I want to do this. Like, I don't like to take too long here, because I want to get into it, but it's fun, like, every now and then to just, like, look at your character's face and just see this just terrifying monstrosity, you know? But the sliders, the sliders themselves take so long, too. Nice spacing, very narrow. Ooh, how high can you make them? about down yeah go back up what is a glabella probably can't even tell from this angle it's like the part above your eye I don't know um eyes too no, nose. Those two. Right, low nose. Oh, look, we make it. Not much lower, apparently. No, I don't like that. The eyes changed location. Gotta make it small. Eyes go back up. Uh, wide nostrils. That has a huge nose. Very flat. Mouth width very wide. Sure. Position down. Some of these you can't even tell that, like, anything's changing. Very cheery. Um. That's fine. Opacity. Oh, that's a t uh, tattoo. See, so I don't want to change this, though. Okay, that's fine. True self? Yeah, I think we're good. So I don't think there's any armor or anything we can uh, wear here. 
no Ornstein armor or anything, so. Probably just gonna use the Seldora set. Gonna throw the bow on. Oh, it's already on. Torpo, 25 arrows. Probably run to Malincha. We'll do Dragon Rider for. Actually, maybe we should go through uh, to the Forest of Fallen Giants. No, mm, I don't know. Let's do that first. Let's we'll get that first bonfire and then uh, go do Dragon Rider. And then I can get the souls to buy a Lenigrass key and then I can buy some. Arrows, as many as we'll need until we do, until we get a great bow. I actually didn't look to see where to buy great arrows. Probably should have done that. Dude, the legs are so skinny. It's so, so weird. I'm not used to, like, being able to see them. We also need Dragon Bone for this thing. Oh, this is going to be obnoxious, actually. Trying to kill him with the bow. Actually, it probably won't be that bad. I might wait until I have more arrows. I'm gonna wait. I just thought about that, because I don't <laughs> I have no idea if I'm even gonna have enough for him. You can bet that every time I'm against a wall I'm gonna turn and uh Face my character. So we can see this gorgeous face. Honestly, I wish I could have made it like more unappealing, but I don't want to take, like I said, too much time in the character creator menu. It's not even it's not, not even like horrible, honestly. I made much worse. But yeah, I think this run's gonna take a long time. Great bows are very slow, <laughs> unfortunately. So it's definitely gonna be on the longer side. And like the DPS isn't that good. The stamina, that's another super annoying thing with great bows is they drain your entire stamina bar in like one shot. So you just shoot, and then you just can't do anything for, like, three seconds because you have no stamina. Not three seconds, but you know what I mean. Like, brief, brief moment. Because I actually did a great bow run, and I remember that was a huge problem. I don't remember how much stamina you need to, like, actually be able to do something after you shoot, but it is probably close to, like, 40 or something. So... Climb. Well, so much for that. Oh, I hate this part, dude. Yeah, I think I'm dead. Okay, never mind, we're good. I think what's freaking me out with the legs is, like, how muscular they are. It looks like they're just bony. This thing shoots pretty quick. 
All right, let's go back to Majula. We're going to do Dragon Rider, get some souls. We'll buy the key for Malentia and then open up the blacksmith shop. And probably do Last Giant. Oh yeah, so I don't know if I mentioned it. Uh, but we are doing an enchanted Dragon Slayer Great Bow. So uh, I don't think there is a lot that's resistant to magic, but there is probably enough that is, you know? The DLCs are going to be rough. Especially Blue Smelter. That fight's going to suck. Every time I do a great bow run in like any of these games, I have to I feel like I have to relearn the fights because it takes so long to attack one time. And also, if you're at range, you know, bosses will behave differently. It's like all sorts of different things going on. Like this part doing that in NG plus. It's going to be very slow, because I, I don't know, Can you hit, maybe you can hit the drake from here, or the dragon, whatever it's called. Wyvern. It's guardian dragon, but... We also need like 30 strength and 20 dex. So we don't need 30, we need like 15 actually. <laughs> I ran into him. Ugh. Good start. And we're hollow. I think my ADP is like super low with this character. Three. I don't know if that's the lowest though. For so I, I think the lowest might be one. Oh, well, you know what it is, now that I think about it? I think the reason sorcerer is the worst. Because I planned for 10 attunement and the sorcerer probably starts with 12. Uh, we can buy... I think the key's a thousand, so we can get, uh, the chime. Are you get 12k for that? Oh my god. That's a lot. Let's buy this. Not eight, just one. And then... Homeward. Yeah, so I think, I think, I'm guessing Sorcerer starts with 12, which is why... Uh, every other class is uh, essentially better, because I'm getting... I think aside from Attunement, the lowest I'm going to have in any stat is like 14 for Vitality. Everything else is going to be over that. So like every other class, basically, like for the endgame build, would have been the same level. Alright, give me this key. And you do not have arrows, which is fine. Because this guy does. Then we'll kill what's his face now. All in. I can't remember if there are arrows in one of these chests, too. Also, I can't really remember who sells arrows. Like, who else sells arrows? 
I think Gavlin probably has like poison arrows. That's a bow. Okay, I thought it was arrows. You have arrows there, right? Surely. Sweet. Wood arrow, iron arrow. Okay, I guess we're going with these. We get how much for these? Fifteen hundred, and then buy them all. Damn, it's a pretty big difference. Fifty to eighty-five, huh? All right, let's go kill all in. Take his clothes. As per usual. Oh, if only I had an infant stamina. This I can't believe he just gets staggered on every shot. You, you won't get me. Already have you. It's too late, buddy. You just don't know it yet. to fight back. Sweet. Let me grab these homeward bones, then we'll go do last giants. Music, hello. <laughs> I don't know why it stops here. I'm trying to remember what the other great bows are. There's one from a DLC enemy. There's the Alani Great Bow. And the last one I don't remember. But there's only four, so we're not gonna have another Great Bow run. For a while, probably. Unless I get a request for one on Twitch or something, but See if that happens. I don't know who's gonna want to watch it. Try or a uh, great bow run in Dark Souls too. You know, there's so many more interesting weapons. I think you could get. I should I should refrain from uh, bashing my own videos, but let's let's say who's gonna want to watch a second great bow run in Dark Souls too. Unless it's like a cool great bow or something. I don't know. Maybe there's a cool one. Uh, but how cool can it be? Like, how, how different can it be? It shoots one-handed. It shoots three arrows at a time. It's like, it's pretty much the same run. Maybe a different infusion and a different upgrade path. Or, well, you know, Twinkling Titanite versus Dragon Bone versus just regular Titanite shards, etc. But, like, it's pretty much the same build. Oh, that's awful. See, like, this attack, I never see this attack because. I never fight this guy from a distance. Okay, so we need to upgrade this thing at ASAP. Maybe there was a better bow to... I don't even know what... Is this a short bow? Yeah. And the durability, I, I think, will be okay, though. Hopefully. I mean, for this fight, it definitely will. I just don't know if it's going to be a problem for other fights.
That's what I mean, though, when I say it's going to be a slow run. Like, it just bows just take a long time. Like, the heavy crossbow run I did was probably twice as long as a normal DS2 run. Granted, it's probably the slowest crossbow. But still. Well, it's just, I feel like they don't get a lot of love in these games. They never seem to be, like, on par DPS-wise with other things. And it's probably just because of PvP, really. Which I get. Because if bows were dealing as much DPS as like other weapons. PvP would probably be a nightmare. Oh, I was literally not even looking at the screen. Turned away for a second. He's wild. Flopping that arm all over the place. Okay, the low ADP is not going to do many favors here. How about we try the, uh, the iron arrows, or whatever they're called? I don't know. McDuff probably has more arrows too, right? Well, that's so much better. Wish I knew that. It's like twice as good. We gotta get through the pursuer. Oh, well, and I can use the ballista for him. It feels like he's not even, like, some of these attacks are, like, I'm not even in range of. But if he's doing them, like, I feel like he's doing them because I am in range. So I feel obligated to dodge them. Like that one, right? Like, why would he do that if I'm not in range of him? I don't think I talked to her yet today. Okay. Uh, let me throw on that. And let's go Ballista the Pursuer. I do not want to know how long it would take if I didn't do this. We'll find out in NG Plus with a great bow. Yeah, I'm trying to think what that last great bow is. But it's not coming to mind. I'm trying to think of what other enemies use one. Dragon Rider? No, Dragon Riders have a regular bow, I think.
I think a blade should help. I think. Actually, you know what? I don't know if it would. I'm gonna do it anyways, because I don't have another ring, so... And then we can upgrade this to plus five. I gotta remember to get all the dragon bone too, because we're gonna need that. I think there's just gonna be so many rough sections on this run, like the uh, Dark Lurker dungeons, I think are gonna be really bad. Well, maybe, I don't know, maybe not. It could be though. But yeah, Smelter Demon, it's going to be pretty painful. Alana, it's going to be pretty rough. That fight is awful with a great bow. Double cats, probably. Not great. Um, hello. Did it? Did that even hit me? I don't know if it did. I don't think it did because I probably would have got staggered out of that. All right, I also forgot firebombs, so let's hope that I don't need them. Otherwise, we're gonna have to waste another homeward bow. Maybe we should just go, you know, let's go. Let's just go get them quickly. Better safe than sorry. Oh, she's not here, is she? Whoops. So yeah, we'll get plus six, and then we'll go to... We'll make our way towards Old Iron uh, Keep. I gotta do artifacts too, though, so... There's no real rush to do Old Iron King. Did I say Old Iron Keep? I always say that. <laughs> old Iron Keep. Old Iron King and Iron Keep. It's... It's confusing. Um... I don't even remember why I'm here. Firebombs. Oh, it's probably too many, but get those two. I'm trying to remember how I started the uh, crossbow run. I think I started it the same way. I just used a bow until I got the heavy crossbow. I can't... No, maybe I... I don't remember if I got a crossbow before the heavy one. Doesn't matter now, though. Okay. See if this guy has arrows. Hopefully he has like at least iron arrows. Infinite iron arrows. Because the wood arrows are not gonna cut it. Alright, let me get large shards, three more. I feel like I'm missing one. Enforce this, uh, yes. And is there something else? Oh, arrows, yeah. Is 30? Ugh. Oh, no, they are 30. I'm sorry. And then he has great arrows. I gotta see who else has great arrows, too. I think Magarold, Mage Rolled, however you say his name. 
I was figured. I was figured his mag rolled. He probably says it. Oh, I should have used a firebomb there, actually. That would have been good. Well, this is not great. Go! Saved. Yeah, I think we'll do this and then we'll we'll go to Iron Keep. Or towards Iron Keep, I should say. Can't get there yet. Oof, that's a plus six bow, and that's not a lot of damage. That's pretty brutal. Dude, Skelly Lords is also going to be pretty miserable. Oh, this is going to suck. Fighting on this tiny little platform with a bow. Or just stagger, just get stun locked. Gotta love ADP. Can you do an attack? Thank you. Dude, what? It went, what? <laughs> Three ADP. That's what that gets you. Come on, man. <laughs> what, what are you doing? Poison arrows would definitely be a good idea. Should probably go get Gavlin, honestly. I think he. I, I'm assuming he has them. I think he's the poison maestro. Alright, we're jumping down. Oh, I didn't think that reach. Luckily, that life gem's going already. Yo, lock on. It shouldn't be too bad, honestly. Like, I, I, I don't think it will. Like, the some of the attacks might kind of be meme just because low ADP. But, like, if you can keep your distance for these guys, I feel like it's not too bad. This attack's not great, though. I hate that speed attack. Twenty. Yikes. Just 
Just a lot of running around, basically. Like, it, what? How? I can't even believe I didn't get hit there. Camera wasn't, like, looking the right way. Just feels like one of those times where you should have been hit, you know? Oof. Spin! Oh my god, I dodged the spin. Okay, that one I'm not dodging. Oh, never mind. Yo, the lock hunt kind of screwed me there. <laughs> They cover way more grand than you think they would in those jump attacks. I'm dead. God. I'm dead. Okay, I gotta stop saying I'm dead. <laughs> Please heal me. Stop doing the spin attacks. idea. Oh my god, I actually dodged that somehow. Alright, well, it's a lot easier now. Can't believe this one still has its shield. I still cannot believe this is a plus six short bow. And it's dealing 102 per hit. All right, easy fight. Never a worry in my mind. It's only like a 10 minute fight. All right, we're gonna go level up. I also have not level up at all, so. I don't know what this bow scales with. Dragon Slayer great bow scales with strength. Well, it scales strength dex, but more strength. And then once we make it uh, enchanted, we give it magic scaling. It, it, magic and strength appeared pretty equal, so. We'll probably need level both. But I think we should do some ADP. I don't think Vigor would be a bad idea either. 
Endurance also would be really good. Way more ADP than this. Like, I don't think strength or dex here really make a difference. We should get the, we need to get to 15 strength though and 20 dex to to use it. So a little more of that. Hints we don't need to worry about yet. Faith, we were gonna get to 18. Tunement, we gotta get to 10. Uh, anything else? Uh, no, I think that's it. More life gems. Pop some of these. I can also. Uh, I forgot I have Estus shards. I gotta remember to not pop the uh, soul, too, by the way. I did that on the Wrathful Axe run. I popped. Well, it would, luckily it was the second Wrathful Axe I was gonna use. So. But I ended up doing, like, Alana at, at like, an NG plus three difficulty or two difficulty. I can't remember what it was. I guess three. All right. So let's go. I got to pop another soul, don't I? Pursuer, sure. Skelly Lords will probably be another long fight. But if we do this now, actually, now that I think about it, we'll uh, we'll get chunks too. So we could do, I guess, after Skelly Lords and after we get some chunks, we could go to Brightstone Cove. Or we gotta, you know, do Najka first, but I also need to get Fragrant Branch, which we can get by going to the Rotten, towards the Rotten. Or I could buy one. Oh, dude, I am so stupid. Forgot I already went here. Oh, wait. I didn't even go the right way, dude. What am I doing? It probably would have been faster to just turn around, but... I use a homeward bone in shame. I didn't talk to her? Oh my god. I made this mistake on, I don't know which, one of the recent runs. I don't know if it was the Sacred Chime Hammer, the Wrathful Axe, or the other one that I'm doing that I isn't probably not out yet. <laughs> or won't be at least when uh this one goes out. That one is brutal. The unnamed run. Alright. Try again. Could go to Gavelin too. Like I, I know I said that before, but I was thinking maybe it's not a bad idea. Move it. So apparently Chariot has a an animation. If you I think you gotta take him down to like a quarter, I think it's a quarter health. If, without closing the gate. So he's still while he's still running around. Apparently he has an animation where uh 
he just like hangs onto the ledge until you shoot him. <laughs> Which I I no clue that was a thing. And if I was doing the boss in new game, I would do it. But because we're doing an NG plus, I just want to use the bow. I don't want to like cheese it or anything. I I don't even know if it's like a cheese necessarily. It kind of reminds me of uh, ceaseless in a way. But I do that, you know, I fight ceaseless normally in NG plus anyway. So it's like I also don't use. Dude, why is this guy not opening the door? Come on, move, move. I'm dead. Is there a guy behind me? There is. Well, this is not good. No, oh, this is bad. I'm dead. Okay, I lived. If I can get by these two dudes, like, then we're fine. Thank you. I'm gonna guess we're gonna we're gonna use like a hundred arrows in this fight. At least. It's gonna be a long fight. Big guy's coming. Oh my god, dude. Okay. Ugh. All right, freedom. Well, I think freedom. How far do these guys, do these guys come all the way up to the fog gate? They probably do. Uh, he was coming. He was trying. A little too slow, though. 55. Oh, boy. Well, sorry. They, they chose different numbers, so the health bar on the bottom says 55. That says 72. Okay, they both say 72. Maybe, maybe it was right. I guess I just hit him, like, twice. It showed two different numbers. The one on the bottom is different than the one on the health bar at the on the enemy itself. I don't know. Well, that was Bone Wheel guy, huh? Oof. When the bone wheels take a long time to kill, you know it's bad. You know you're not dealing much damage. Okay, yeah, one's dead.
Oof. I think the, the skeleton lord that summons the bone wheels is like the weakest one. As the one with the least health anyway. Now we just go around in circles for the next 10 minutes. Will we fight like 30 skeletons? You know, it's funny, I see a lot of, the, I think, the Ruin Sentinels in that Skeleton Lord. Like, he has the, the thrust and then the backswing attack that the Ruin Sentinels also have. Oh, here we go. It's going to be three hits for each one of these guys. <laughs> and that's with the good arrows. And also if they don't block. Ugh. This is how, like, every bow run, every crossbow run, every great bow run is going to be, unfortunately. Skeleton Lords like this. Although I am happy I have a plus six. That's definitely a good idea. I think it's just little skellies left, no big ones. Those guys are dead. Oh, never mind, there's one big one. Right here. Almost there. How did that do less damage to him? It did 30. He wasn't blocking it. Skeleton load, so... Any, uh, alerting skulls? Got one. That's it? Wow. Oh. Stingy. Very stingy drops. I guess we can go to Covetous Demon next. I guess, well, that's where we're headed, so. 
I'll grab the chunks. We can upgrade to plus seven. The nice thing is, too, with the Dragon Slayer Rape, but we don't need to worry about saving chunks or anything. I should go and do Nashka, though. Instead of Covetous Demon. Which I might do. Just so we can get the other chunks in the slab. After her. But I need to go to the Rotten, or towards... I need to go down to the Gutter. Or I guess Black Gulch, actually. Because I need a bonfire static. Not, not, sorry, fragrant branch. Let me get this first, though. These chunks, I'll also move her. I do need dragon bone. Luckily, we don't need like 30 dragon bone, though. Just need the 15. Alright. Get me out. He's coming. I probably have to kill him. Oh, never mind. We're good. All right, get the cat ring. We'll go down to Black Gulch. She got back here faster than I did. And I teleported here. Insane speed. Oh, I'm gonna buy some skulls too, I think. Uh, she only has 10? Really? Does she get infinite later on? Oh, those are bones, I'm sorry. Well, also only has 10 of these too, so... Technically, I was right. Should probably get some homework ones, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, so we'll go get the... Fragrant Branch. I hate doing this part. I can never remember where I have to land. I missed a spot. Oh, I should look. I really should look over the ledge. I just kind of wing it based on what feels right. You kind of go where there's like a little indent right here. That's where I think you're supposed to go. Perfect. So we have one iron arrow. Uh oh. Wait, what? My frames? From from what? <laughs> what? I don't know what just happened.
Yeah, I kind of figured, like, it probably is better to just get this fragrant branch, because we're going to go here anyways, rather than spend 12k on the one from Malentia. Plus, we'll, you know, this will give us progress towards the Rotten, who we have to do at some point. Well, technically, I guess you don't, because of the whole needing enough souls for that door thing. So technically, like, anything before that point is optional. Which is pretty crazy to think about. Like the first half of DS2 is pretty much just full of optional bosses. I'm trying to think if there is one you need to do. I don't think there is, though. Uh, maybe there is. I don't know. But I guess not, right? Like, the only important thing, I think, is you get to the Forest of Fallen Giants for Giant Lord, but you don't need to do any other bosses. You can just skip them. Like, the minimum number of bosses would be... One... Dragon Rider Duo looking last night. Where are we going? We're going to... Dragon Rider Duo, Looking Glass Knight, Demon of Song, Velstat, Guardian Dragon, Giant Lord, The Throne Duo, and Nishandra. That's it. But it would require, like, just insane farming in the first half of the game, which would not be worth it. Alright. Let's see. Or ADP. A little more vigor, too. Apparently very little. Oh yeah, I wanted to upgrade. I forgot about that. Let's get to the Shaded Ruins bonfire and then I'll do that. So we have... Two chunks so we can get plus seven. Any little bit, every little bit helps. Oh, he moved out of the way. How nice. I think I need to pop another boss soul. So I don't think this is enough. I, it's probably a good thing to do that anyways, just because I need more arrows too. Oh, the, the chewing sound is so weird. Those guys are just chewing on the corpses. So strange. The only sad thing is there's no way to uh, power stance bows, right? Because the crossbow run, we can power stance, but this one, not so much. So this guy likes tuckered out. All right, what do we need? We need, I oh, know, sorry, we need to reinforce that and 
There's something else? Like crazy? Arrows. Boom. Take a quick trip through here. Get the Clorothy ring. I can never tell where it is. Oh, somehow found it. And I think I'm going to call this one here. It's a good start. Uh, next time, hopefully, we can get the... Uh, well, we still got a lot to do before we get the bow. But we'll get hopefully near getting it if we don't get it. But yeah, that's the plan. Thanks for watching, guys.